Hey guys, today I'm going to go over the contents of my, my day pack, what I'd carry out for a three, two, three hour hike to an all day adventure. Um, this is the pack I would take. It's very versatile. It's the Maxpedition Falcon 2 and has, it's just a great all around pack. Very expandable, you know, it's a 1000 denier, nylon, YKK, zippers, blah, 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 molly attachment, yada, yada. Uh, poly triple coated whatever you know it's just a great pack I've taken this to the desert climates of Zambia and the jungle environments of Papua New Guinea and lots of places in between um, great great pack I love it so this is what I take when I go out on the day uh, day hikes and uh, all day adventures I'm gonna start with uh, what I have on the outside of my pack first of all here I have a, a Max Edition roly-poly just big enough for uh, my clean canteen water bottle and uh, also inside this is a titanium cup that fits quite nicely in, in this uh, size of roly-poly and I can cook with that on the fire if I want to or um, just use it to drink, you know, cook on the stove. On the front of the pack, on these straps, there's all kinds of, of web gear and so on, but here I have um, one of my fixed blade knives. This one happens to be the uh, Ontario Rat 3. And then in this pocket here, there's a water bottle uh, reservoir pouch here, which I have a 100 ounce water bottle uh, bladder. And I just have a couple of carabiners on either side, uh, just for utility items, hanging things at camp or uh, hanging them off my pack or whatever. They're just there for um, whatever I might need as it becomes as it comes up. Now let's go over the front pockets. In the smallest pocket here uh, I have a cell phone, some cordage, uh, some paracord, more cordage, a uh, bag for because my dog usually comes with me on hikes and that's a, to pack his crap out of the woods, uh, lens cleaner um, and a Bic lighter. In the lower front pocket, I have a headlamp, a Silver Ranger compass, some snacks and drink mix, uh, some coffee packets, a Gerber a knife sharpener, and a bandana. In the middle compartment, I have uh, some maps of the areas that I hike, some gloves, a, another fixed blade knife, this is the Becker BK2, a uh, Laplander saw, some toiletry items, a little trowel, some uh, mountain money there, and some hand sanitizer, and a quart size Ziploc bag. For the main compartment, one of the things I love about this bag, and one of the reasons I got it, was that the main compartment is a clamshell design, so it's really easy to pack and unpack to get to all of your gear, because it just opens right up. And in here I have a, an emergency, uh, reusable emergency blanket that I can also use for a shelter, uh, ground cloth, um, you know, just put it over me in the case of an, an emergency to keep myself warm. I have a cook kit, and this is a, uh, a Marmot pre-sip uh, jacket in case it gets bad weather. First aid kit, and this is my uh, Maxpedition EDC pocket organizer, and this is, no, it is 
just has items in it that are uh, in case of emergency, also just items that I tend to transfer from bag to bag depending on where I'm going, what I'm doing, and so it's just easy to organize them in this uh, pouch. And just to give you a quick look, um, I actually review this kit uh, in another video, uh, but you can see I have it full of things that I um, just would use on an ongoing basis as well as some items that I hope I never use, signaling and emergency type items. And then there's a small mesh pocket here that I just have uh, some more toilet paper. So this is what uh, my day pack looks like on. It's very narrow, so when you're hiking through brush and so on, it doesn't hang up on things. It's, um, it fits very well on the back, very comfortable. It's padded. So the contents I showed you in the pack, I would consider kind of on the heavy end of what I carry. Um, I don't always carry two fixed blade knives. Um, I don't always carry a cook set. You know, it really depends on what plans I have while I'm out, where I'm going, what kind of things I want to do, how long I'm gonna, I plan on being there, and I just pack accordingly. Um, sometimes I take a firearm with me, sometimes I don't. Um, there's a, where the water bladder is on the Falcon 2, there's a, a hook and loop field where you can have a holster for a concealed uh, firearm. And so, there's, the pack is just very versatile, and um, what I pack in it uh, tends to vary according to where I'm going. But I just showed you some of the contents um, of the things that I typically carry if I'm going to go maybe on an all-day type of uh, day hike without necessarily going overnight. But if I'm caught after dark or something happens where I have to stay the night, I feel like I'm pretty prepared uh, with the contents of what you saw in the, in the bag. Well, I appreciate you taking the time to watch and hope to see you again. Uh, out in the wilds and you hope you have a great day. The contents I showed you today I think are more of a there's a plane going overhead. Suburban life. <laughs>